morning everyone today we are taking the next topic of our chapter that is female reproductive system right and we have studied that day the male reproductive system today today we are taking the female reproductive system right so female reproductive system consists of the primary organs and the primary organs or gonads in the human female are known as ovaries right these are 2 to 4 cm in length these are the basic structure or the organ in which female gamete formation takes place and which is the female gamete or what is the female gamete that is ova so naturally you can say that the formation of ova takes place inside the ovary so many ova formation takes place inside the ovary or the formation of eggs takes place inside the ovary right so eggs are the female gamete right ovary consists of double membrane and the stroma is filled in between the membranes the inner membrane is said to be medulla and the external membrane or the peripheral membrane is said to be cortex so this is ovary right and the female reproductive system consists of paired fallopian tubes ovaries are also paired in number these are almond shaped and fallopian tubes or the oviducts are also pair in number or two in number fallopian tube is further divided into so many parts for example you can say these finger like projections are said to be fimbri what is the function of fimbri to capture the ova during the time of ovulation and what is ovulation the releasing of ova from the ovary at each 27th or 28th day of the month in human female so the capturing of ova during the ovulation is takes place by means of fimbri these finger like projections and then the ova goes to the infundibulum this whole part is said to be infundibulum and the uh, this bulging structure of fallopian tube or oviduct is said to be ampulla right ampulla and that tube is said to be isthmus so ova travel from fimbri to infundibulum ampulla and it remains here for two days right so here the fertilization takes place so where is the fertilization takes place exam mein question aata hai ye to aap likhenge ampullary isthmus junction whenever you are studying in the 12th class 10th mein to aap likh dete the in the fallopian tube hame wahan mention karna padega ki kis jagah par fallopian tube likhne se aapko marks nahi milenge aapko wahan likhna padega ampullary isthmus junction so where is the fusion of male sperm and female ova takes place in the ampullary isthmus junction right so paired ovary and paired fallopian tube are present in the female reproductive system then this pear shaped structure aap keh sakte hain ki ye humne nashpati hoti hai ya pear inverted pear agar hum rakhe to aise hi structure aayegi upar se broad hai ye aur niche se narrow hai that is known as uterus theek hai ye hamara kya hai uterus hai अगर हम यूट्रस की बात कर रहे हैं तो ये पूरा बैग लाइक स्ट्रक्चर होता है इन विच द डेवलपमेंट ऑफ बेबी टेक्स प्लेस एंड द यूटराइन मेम्ब्रेन्स आर डिवाइडेड इन टू थ्री राइट द इनर वन इज एंडोमेट्रियम द मिडिल वन इज मायोमेट्रियम द आउटर वन इज पेरीमेट्रियम और यू कैन से द आउटर मेम्ब्रेन ऑफ यूट्रस इज सेट टू बी पेरीमेट्रियम द मिडिल वन इज मायोमेट्रियम एंड द इनर वन इज एंडो मैट्रियम सो वॉट इज द फंक्शन ऑफ एंडोमेट्रियम वॉट इज द फंक्शन ऑफ माइओमेट्रियम सो 
the cyclic changes takes place during the menstruation cycle are takes place by means of endometrium membrane i am repeating again the changes during the menstruation cycle takes place in the human female are controlled by the endometrium or it takes place by means of endometrium and all the contraction events takes place during the time of delivery or the parturition takes place whenever the baby comes out from the womb of mother it takes place by means of myometrium cells of myometrium contract during the time of parturition right that canal is said to be cervical canal by which the sperms can enter during the time of copulation this is canal cervical canal and the opening of cervical canal is said to be vagina so what is vagina this is the birth canal or the canal by which the menstruation flow takes place so this is all about the female reproductive system whenever we are talking about the female reproductive system it contains the paired mammary glands also this is the characteristic feature that is the mammary glands are present in the human female right so we will study the mammary glands later on so this is all about the female reproductive system